Okay, hi everyone. So, I haven't filmed a video in a while <laughs> because I've been busy working, doing stuff, school. Um, so, I'm gonna do it now. So, okay. So, okay. So, way back at day three, we're now at day 10. <laughs> but at day three, we. Ooh, that's not good, Latin. Okay. At day three, we made beef vegetable soup. And mine went good. I mean, it could have used a little more salt, but that's a recurring theme. <laughs> um, and here's a picture of it. Um, and then, um... Um, and then on day four, so I have two days in a week, so day three and four are together. Um, day four we made French onion soup, and it was delicious, but mine could have used more salt, but it looked so pretty. Actually, I think, if I remember right, my salt was good, but I just needed to toast the, um, cheese on top a little bit more. Because if I toasted the cheese, the salt in the cheese would have, um, brought out more of the salt. So it would have been fine. So the seasoning of the soup, of the onion soup, was good. I just the because of the bread and the, all that. So and then next the next week we did we on day five we made chicken consomme, which is basically just like um like you get like a ground chicken or beef or whatever it is and you cook it in veg in um stock of whatever beef or chicken or whatever um and then you um let the and with some like um mirepoix as well and you just let the um like it the basically it kind of forms like a ball on top of the soup all of the like beef and mirepoix and stuff um, and it takes out all the impurities of the stock and it leaves you with like a really clear soup and so and that so that was one thing we made I actually forgot to take a picture of that so I'm sorry <laughs> but mine didn't turn out perfect it could have been more clearer than it turned out to be but um, I am gonna we're gonna remake that um, tomorrow which would be day 11 um, so in my next video I'll have a picture of it um, we're gonna remake it because um, we're gonna after we remake it for next week we're gonna remake it again um, the week after that because that's our midterms and consomme is one thing that we need to master for our midterms okay so and then day six we made um, whipped potatoes which were delicious <laughs> and then we made potato and leek puree soup and that was delicious too um, and so there's a picture of that um, and then we made day seven we made um, so this was the next week day seven we made puree of lentil soup and then we, we made croutons and um, we made croutons and um, why can't I think of it? Um, bacon, little bacon crispies um, on top for like crunchiness, you know, and it was so good. Um, and then And then the next day we made fish chowder, which was, again, so good. <laughs> um, so. Oh, that was delicious. Um, and then the next week, which was last week, we made cream of broccoli soup. Um, oh, so day the puree of leek soup and the um potato leek puree soup and the puree of lentil soup both of those could be seasoned more with salt 
with just salt because we really only season with salt and pepper and stuff um and then so and then the fish chowder um same thing could have used more salt the cream of broccoli soup though my seasoning he said it was great and it made me so happy because to this day everybody in our um class Oh, they always were like, well, you need more salt, you need more salt, you need more salt. And then mine, he was like, your salt was great. And I was like, oh, like I was so happy. So then, um, and then. Day 10, which was Wednesday of last week, we made one quart of beach mall. Um, and for the beach mall, we made, um, um, so we made beach mall and then, um, from the beach mall, we made so so we made, um, sauce Mornay, um, which is basically beach mall, beach mall sauce with, um, uh, butter with more butter and more, um, cheese. Um, and then from sauce Mornay, we made cauliflower gratin and actually the picture I have of this one um, the, it is actually not mine, um, because I forgot to take a picture of mine before I brought it up for tasting. Um, so I took a picture of someone's in my groups and his looks a little better than mine. It was just, mine was good and the seasoning was good as well. So it was like my second day in a row that my seasoning was great. And I was like so freaking happy. Um, but my toasting, it wasn't as toasted, but it was still like, good and delicious and salt was good so that's a good thing um and then on also on day um one of the early days and really every day we make um clarified butter which is basically we cook we melt butter and we melt it down so um the fat and the the fat is like in the middle and then the water goes on is on bottom and then the um like dairy milk what's left in it um is like on top so then you skim out what's on top and then um depending on different methods you either wait for the water to boil to like boil off or you um let it or you ladle the fat off of it and you so you just use the fat and it's and then you we fridge it we fridge it we we cool it and we put it in the refrigerator until we use it until we have to use it for like we make we use it for a lot of different things basically just as oil um it's just pure fat <laughs> delicious so oh and then one more thing me and my friend ariana um was we're driving actually earlier today we went to napa um and we took a back road and i took a video of the view because it was gorgeous so so that'll be at the end but um i just wanted to say bye um hopefully i'll won't have to do this again while I have to talk about 12 different ones and I'll actually do them all in a row and it'll be easy but um yeah next week um we're making mayonnaise I think and hollandaise sauce and I'm really sh stressed about the hollandaise sauce because <laughs> that's um everyone's like oh your hollandaise will break it's difficult and so I'm like Ooh. so I'm nervous about that um but so yeah, so hopefully I'll see you next week. <laughs>